Hello, this is uh, Krenstar, and I'm going to try to do something probably a little stupid. Uh, I'm gonna, I am uh, gonna. tried recording a video last night, and I uh, uh, screwed it up majorly. I had a lot of crackling, and I had to take it back off. Um, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try to uh, fix that post-mortem, uh, post, uh, as they call it. Um, as far as I know... Reaper is really good for editing uh, or fixing audio off of a video. Um, I had to download VLC for the native or the, the codec that that uh, defaults in uh, OBS to be able to read this. Uh, so you might have to down download VLC and, and Reaper. Um, but once it's in, it's it's there. So the sound is. And if you can hear it really low, there's a there's a like a crackling or a, a, a type of noise going on, and I wanted to see if I can fix this. Uh, so basically, I'm probably going to try to use uh, Isotopes RX tools uh, de click de de uh, clip de hum uh, de noise one of these to try to remove uh, that that crackling sound. Uh, that sounds like it's 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 uh, basically uh, either the processor didn't catch up or uh, a it's clipping or or uh, <laughs> I think I might have caused it because part of the video in there. If you watch, well, if I fix this, I'm gonna post the video too. But if, uh, if you watch the video, I put in the um, Arturia's uh, mellow thing, and I gave it a pretty hefty noise, and I think that's the clicking or the the crackling from the noise. Um, but it's a good time. It's a good chance to, to try to use these tools to try to uh, figure out. And I don't hear any clipping. Oh, this actually worked really well. Look at those amount of clicks that it's saying it's repaired. Yeah, you hear that clicky goodness? And I think I did this to myself. All right. Once I'm once I'm happy with the the end result, that was that easy. All I have to do is render it now. So I'm gonna um, render in here. All of this is set up for videos, so I got it to go into my video folder. Um, I'm gonna have it uh, FMP, M, F, FFmpeg and a QT MOV, um, same frame rate, and then make it an MPEG and just hit render file. Um, this might take I'm wondering if my audio is going to be off from my Let's cancel this for a second cuz it, it, it looks like it's off. Let me run, run this all the way back to start. Oh, it is off. I'm glad I looked. But let me move the file over. All right, now... We'll try a rendering and it should within a bar go yeah overwrite it there we go and 
in about two minutes. This should, um, this should, uh, uh complete. Um, like I said, I'm gonna re-upload the, I'm gonna upload this as probably today's video and upload the other one as a, um, as yesterday's video again. Um, name of the, name of the video is, um, hunting down the aliens that stole my car keys, since it seems kind of, um, alien hunter-ish, like Spongebob and Patrick, um, that, that, that cut sort of, uh, uh, 80s, uh, vibe of the, uh, uh, alien movies back in the days, not aliens, or, or the, the Xena, uh, anyways, the, the, the thing, I'm talking about just alien movies. Uh, or sci-fi movie. Sci-fi alien. Almost done. And then once this is done, you can it should it should create the MOV in the output and it should play just as normal. Um forty two seconds more on this. Probably feel free to, to skip to it if you're actually really interested. But otherwise, um Thanks for uh, watching. <laughs> if, you, if you lasted this long, uh, 28 seconds. Um, this is actually ex pretty cool. It uh, um, post processing after the video. Most my, most of the time I make these videos, I don't save the the patches and reason or anything, so they're pretty much gone. Uh, so post production wise. Uh, this is like a godsend, and it looks like it's almost finishing up. So once this is done, we close it, and we go back to the folder. You see the untitled M uh, MOV. Now if we go to the original you can hear the crackling say so I put the mellify in there and I crank some stuff up so it, it's this is the crackling is probably the mellify doing this of all things. But uh, um, I, I think it did a pretty excellent job of removing that, that sound that I accidentally put in uh, and then thought about later. So, uh, um, again, thanks for watching.